All right, hello library friends. We are gonna show you today how to use one of my favorite databases that you have access to with your library card. It is called BookFlix. And uh, my daughter here is being my helper. So your first step is that you wanna go to the library's website, tscpl.org. Then you're gonna go click on where it says download it. And you're gonna click on eBooks. And you're going to scroll down to the bottom and click on that button that says BookFlix. BookFlix is a fantastic resource for um, younger kids in particular, like kindergarten to third grade. It has all kinds of cool books on it. Um, usually when you get to this page, you'd be putting in your library card number. It looks like Scholastic has that turns off right now, so it's even easier than usual. So go ahead and click on Start. One of the things that I love about BookFlix is the radio and have some fun. that it is designed with emerging read readers online. in mind. So even if your kid can't read on their Learning own yet, they can navigate the Listen website independently. Tell you what to do. Why don't you go ahead and click pick something out? Or click on the feature to begin. So you can see all the books here are in pairs. A bunch of them have this red banner that says ES. That means it's also available in Spanish, Espanol. Um, and each pair is going to have a animated video of a storybook and then a nonfiction book that the kid can, your kid can read on their own or they can have it read to them. Why don't you go ahead and pick one? So many cool choices. There we go, duck for president. So you see there's watch the story, read the book. And then there's all kinds of cool games that go with it there's too. There's a word match, fact or fiction, which came first. You wanna show us one of those? Sure. Read the clue below. Click on the word it matches. Now this Match would work better to uncover a picture. if she'd already Design read the book. <laughs> But Back. my sixth grader probably has enough background information to know what the right answer Democracy. is here. Clue to sign up for something. Leader. To sign up for something? Vote. Yeah. Register. Nice work. To choose someone or something. Vote. Nice work. A form of government in which people choose their leaders. Nice work. A person who guides others. Lead. Nice work. Pieces of paper on which voters mark their choices. Nice work. A group of people who make laws for a country. Nice work. If you noticed, it read her all the clues out loud. So a kid who's just learning how to read can use this site really independently and be very successful. There are tons of different choices. Will you go back to the home screen so we can see all the different categories again? Click on a category. So animals. you can, your kid can pick something that they are interested in. Animals and nature, earth and sky, people and places, ABCs and one, two, threes, adventure, family and community, celebrations, music and rhythm, and imagination. There you go. And you can see there's all these great picture clues too. Um, and then there's also a featured pair. Let's show them one more thing. Go ahead and click and on I the... And I think this one will be in music and rhythm. Probably. Go ahead and click on read the book. I want to show them how it reads along. So see this button right here says read... Oh, sorry. Read along. So that's where your child can have the book read to them. And no it highlights the words. Hello. A ringing telephone is a sound too. So there you go. Singing, talking, and laughing are also sounds. But you can also turn that off if this is something that your child can read on their own or if you're doing sitting down with them and you're reading it together. Um, so like I said, BookFlix is a fantastic 
learning tool, the, all kinds of cool books. Um, there's video book, video story books, and then the read-alongs like these of nonfiction sí. books. Español. Oh, there we go. Showing off some. They're in English and Spanish. Um, I might be able to read some. Very of easy to read. Yeah, it might appeal to your older readers if they're trying to learn Spanish or um, kids who are bilingual who want to read in both languages. So um, definitely geared towards younger readers, but lots of applications for okay, older yeah, kids okay. too. Anyone who loves to read. Free with your library card. Actually, it looks like right now it's free anyway. Um, I hope you'll check it out, and I'll attach the link, the direct link, to this video. Have a great day. Oboes can cry. <laughs> I feel like we need to give a shout-out to Jim Mosier. Bye, guys. See ya.